clearly says it on my top. So we are in our booth now. We got here yesterday. I didn't want to vlog yesterday because we were up, well, we were up since like half three in the morning. I didn't go to bed till like quarter to one in the morning. So it was a long ass day. So we are in a little bit of a apartment with an amazing view, which I shall show in a minute because it's not going to focus very well. But I'll give you a little bit of a room tour before we go because we're going to go to San Antonio today, which is like, hang on, let me show you. Which we are going all the way over there, but we're walking it because we have to go like all the way around. Yeah, this is our view from our room. We had a lovely sunrise this morning. Got a pool down there. It's really lovely. But anyway, I'll show you a room tour. So we've got this on the balcony, all my shit there, and then kind of mess up the bed, but yeah, a charging station. We've got those massive bottles of water, 61 cents, so obviously you can't really drink the water here, so we've got our little shoes down there. A little kitchen, it's cute, we've got a little eating area. There are our wardrobes, mirror, obviously. This is my outfit of the day. Bought this top yesterday. And we're matching. Yeah! Let's have a look in the bathroom. Massive doors that you can hear everything through. Great. It's got this nice shower, like overhead shower. And obviously a toilet, classic. His and her sides, obviously. And a massive mirror. Not a bad size room at all. We're in the Playa Bella Apartments in Ibiza. So in the fridge, we have got soya yogurt, obviously. Got lots of fruit, salad, chorizo cheese, dairy-free chocolate, obviously. Apple juice, almond milk, they actually have it over here. It makes me so happy. And then we have eggs, that one's a bit fucked. Um, and then they've got their own version of like Monster, which Adam had, so. And then we've got some little bits up here. Adam's made some eggs to take with him. We made, well no, Adam made an omelette yesterday. And it just scrambled eggs because we didn't have any oil. We thought we had a non-stick pan. Was not. Salt, Mento, Suvers, vitamin tablets because we need to keep healthy. Hence the fruit and everything. A little hob here. That microwave comes in handy. And then in here, we've got lots of other snacks. Which I bought with us as well. We actually bought Spanish custard. And we had these donuts. These here, which we ended up wrapping up. Got some pasta that I'm going to make later. Everything was quite cheap and obviously I've got some I've got some noodles. And then I've got my gluten free Astro Bites. I love them from Morrison's. These are a good little extra thing on top of my breakfast that I love. And then obviously we've got some vegan sweeties as well. That I brought with us. And then I've got some, I really fancy some crisps but I didn't know what I wanted so I just got them. It's got cheese in it but whoops. And then we've got some Spanish little cakes. Yeah. That is our food so far. Adam's going to make me like a little pizza lately. L lately? Later. So I'm excited about that. Because Adam does some good cooking. Other than that, we're going to go to San Antonio. Adam, show me your top. See, look. We're matching. Yeah. Good. Let's go. We went to the skinny kitchen, went all around San Antonio, had a shower, you can see my hands are wet. We came back, it's a very long walk, but we actually did it quite fast. We went and sat by the pool for a little bit, and now Adam's cooking me some lovely dinner. I'm going to sit on the balcony and have some dinner, and then get ready, and then go out to make up on the space. Look at that. Thank you, darling. All ready to go, and I'm wearing a very, very bright, obviously pink outfit. This is from Femlock. I feel like it's a bit like too much. I'm going to wear out of it and I really like the skirt. I feel like the top is a bit too booby, should I say? It's a cute set. really like it. I'm going to go out now. Ready babe? Yeah ma'am. Yeah ma'am. <laughs> okay we're at rooftop nine. Something like that. What? Is it rooftop nine Adam? Yeah. Rooftop. Rooftop. And it's so funky. And the view is lovely. Just 
just like that, we're back at the hotel. So we had a little wander around. Look how glowy my skin is. I've used an Elizabeth Arden Sew My Capsule as well as some Estee Lauder face cream. But it's in like a little pot. I can't remember. I'll have to show you. But I'm going to do a IGTV holiday skincare routine because I change it up a little bit when I go on holiday. But yeah, so it's more glowy. So we sat in bed because uh, we decided to come back and just watch a film. <coughs> actually watching American Pie The Wedding because it's the only thing that's on that's actually acceptable to watch. And last night we watched Riverdale at like midnight. I had my fucking eyes out. I was actually bawling like it was just, it was so sad. If you watch Riverdale, like this video, comment down below if you watched it. If you haven't, you need to watch it and take tissues with you because it, it was just so sad, so sad. I was texting Stacey at like quarter to one in the morning. Hey Stacey, I cried so hard. I sent her a picture of my face at how hard I was crying. I can't believe how glowing my skin is. Woo! So we're gonna head to bed after watching this. Earlier we were looking at all these random hotels. We went to rooftop nine, I think that's what it was. That was really pretty. But obviously it wasn't busy because we were out of season, but some nice photos anyway, just for the gram. And then we ended up going to Paradiso, which is that really, really nice Instagramable place. And took photos in there as well, obviously. Can't not for the gram. And it's all pink, and I was wearing a pink outfit, so I had to do that. Could not. A great little photographer over here. Eat his biscuit. We shall see you in the morning. Getting some more snacks. My fitty. <laughs> Adam's making his overnight oats. And we got spaghetti bolognese on the go with this. Everything costs like so cheap. This whole meal costs like six euros. And if you go out, hand out this for one, it'll be like ten euros. It's heaven knows money. Woo! This is actually really nice salmon milk, especially with custard. And dinner is served. A little bit of cheese on top and leftovers for another day. Looks so good, doesn't it? We went over there earlier as well. It's like a derelict sort of like a hotel, it's like ruins, like they probably didn't plan it properly. We're going to take some photos in there one day. Great, I've got a family lot of people Hello, so we're currently at the place called Tulip. Big dog over there, a bit weird. Funky vibes in it though. Mm. There's just sort of coffee and um, apple juice. Morning. brought my secret scent box with me which I think I showed in my other vlog but either way the DKNY perfume is in there Davidoff Cool Water and the Beyonce heat kiss is in there and I've got my little Danielle Beauty bag in there as well about to have some Weetabix this is soaked with almond milk poor Adam's poorly it is a beautiful morning oh, it was the clouds come over got a nice bit of watermelon as well I also bought these yesterday, so they look interesting. Little bits of fruit jellies. Well, I've also got a trolley burger because I used to love these as a kid. Like for, the, for like 40 cents. Absolutely love these. Nails are still going strong. Bit of a random thing to show you, but I'm just about to shoot for organic basics. And I've got a few little bits on from there. Also, going to shoot this t shirt, and I'm wearing these right now as well. Cutest little sets. A really nude, nice blues. They do black, white, and then they're gonna be like blush pink colour as well. And they're so nice and so comfortable. I'm gonna shoot this for Instagram. I found a vegan place. Oh, it's so small. What we'll colour would it be on the vegan? <laughs> we are in San Antonio again, and we're gonna go to. I can't remember what the hotel name is, but it's at the start of the sea, but you'll see it in a bit. I've just seen the vegan point, um, little cafe thing. Don't think I'd eat in there though, I think we're going to go to Kick Eye Beauty, I think it's called. Uh, it's a healthy, healthy cafe. We're going to go to this aqua, what did I call it? Aqua, aquarium, that's the one. Okay, we're going to go there and just wander around. Bit of a shit place, but the Arvita rocks those out. It doesn't even look that special. It's not. Is it? Where's the entrance? There's the entrance. So much for that, it's shut. <laughs> we found the Wiki Woo Hotel. So snazzy. 
in a gorgeous location too. We're off to find the Cubanito Hotel so we get some uh, pictures for the gram obviously. I found it on Instagram the other day, I thought it looked pretty snazzy. Can I find it? Should be around the corner. Found it! And it has a car outside. The picture shot at Cubanito and now we're going to go to the aquarium. Look this nice view. How blue it is. I think we're going like over there somewhere. Our hotel's like there somewhere. Oh wow, very different than that. Simple on some little caves. So beautiful. Quick pit stop food, absolutely sweating. Guess what we found? Little. Little. Get some fresh. There it is. See if they've got that. I swear we love food shopping more than we do actual shopping. I suppose they do. Not much in here, but see how yeah. I'm a bit of bingo. <laughs> Just realised I actually have vlogged in like hours, but we're at the hotel playing at bingo. Apart from the we went to Winter Paradise, so hope it's going to be open. Probably shut for the season. Great. We're going to play bingo instead. Also bought a new band. <laughs> My 2016 one broke, it's only 2 euros so I got my old one from 3 years ago, the shiny one. Thought we'd have a good crazy golf. Mm. Like we'll hold them up playing that. Hello, we are in Ibiza Old Town now, well, it's Ibiza Town. Of yeah, it smells, it doesn't smell very good here. The drains don't smell good. You're looking there. Yeah, so we're in uh, Ibiza Old Town and we're going to wear uh, no time in our car. We'll try again. So we're in Ibiza Town, we're going to do a little bit of shopping. We came here on the bus, it took about half an hour, would you say? And literally a 10 year old got on the bus with a Christian Dior bag. Obviously it's a fake one, but I'm going to try and find one. Because if she's got one, I can get one. Ain't paying too grand for that, she has a four bar. She's getting lipstick, I've got all these colours. Currently in Polar Bear and I found a few bits. Woo! Just checking in, we're going up to Old I yeah. Ibiza Old Town. I'm dying for a wee, like really badly. I bought a few little bits so far. I bought some really cute clips in this shop as well. So hopefully we can stop for a wee soon. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go up to the higher point now. Now we've stopped for a wee and a drink at that cute little place that I found on Instagram before. But it wouldn't rate it because Adam's coffee cost two euro twenty, and it was like this fucking big. Don't recommend the coffee there. Definitely not. We're gonna go and see the view now, and then possibly have some lunch. Well, that's far down. to the top and what a view it is sweaty mess right now I need a wee again lunch is served Adam's got a chicken salad and I've got chicken and chips but now, oh, you can as well we're now back in uh, our area of Playa Bella and there's literally a storm brewing that we can hear in the background but um, look at them going through some shops that's just getting louder first storm that we've had we're going to look at this Indian place because we want to come here for dinner but we're literally going to come here look at the shops and then go back and chill for a bit and probably just watch the storm out the window they're literally electric so I've been here before when there's storms I think it's, oh I don't think it's open look at that Ooh. there's a big bit of lightning that just went off there Back in the room now after we just got absolutely drenched and it only lasted what about 20 minutes? So back at the hotel and I'm gonna do a little haul for you and show you what I got. Oh I also bought this um yesterday, I think. Yeah, and bought another one with the unicorn on it, it's pink. That's in name. So we just went in a bag shop where they've got like loads of dupe bags and I bought this. I feel like it looks like a Chanel bag that I saw. 
It was all pink and it was 19 euros 50, which is actually not bad in uh, my eyes. Let's just open it up and I shall show you what it looks like inside. So it comes with a strap and it's like quite big, quite a big box bag, a zip in there. It would look really cute in the summer and possibly the winter, but mainly like spring, summer, I thought it really cute. And I also picked up this scarf from one of the shops that were called La Serena. Can we tell I love pink? And it's a pashmina scarf and it was like 4 95 it was reduced from 8 95 to 4 95 so yeah, I thought that looks really, really pretty and they look nice together too actually. Especially with like my pink dress or something. Cute, love it. And I think that's gonna look really nice with the white coat that I bought from the charity shop not so long ago. Yeah, love the print of that. In Ibiza, old time I went into this shop called Ruta Ibiza and they had so many quirky little things and I picked up these clips. They were two euros each. I think they were four euros each, these ones. They're so cute. It's a baby and nice and I really like how they're like diamante. And I've got one of these in like white pearl and I don't have any like colourful ones. So I think obviously I love pastel sort of colours so that's going to look really, really cute together. I love her clips at the minute. They're so cheap as well, like just as cheap as eBay. I told you I bought another one. Two euros, this little band with the unicorn on. Love it, that's mine. And that's Adam's. So they've both got one that says 2019 on. And now I've got another one of these. And then I've got my other one that I've got from like three years ago. We also went in some shops and I bought some Apple Mentos. I've literally been loving Mentos since I've been here. And I've never tried Apple ones before. And then I looked at this and I thought... It's worth a shot. Looks like a bueno, kind of. But it's like 80 cents or something, so. Oh, and let's have a look at what I got in Zara. So I picked up just a few basic things. Um, just some tank tops. They were 5 95 And oh my god, the material is so soft. So I got just like your classic basic colours. Neutral palette, basically. So I got black, white, and a nude. Like, it's kind of like a brownie nude. But it's so nice. You should feel them. They just, they feel so good. It's so soft. Then I also went into Sephora, hang on. So I didn't get too much in Sephora, but I have one of these, as you probably already know, that says we on it. Um, I don't know what else I've got there. I've got a couple more. This is from Sephora, loves Barcelona. That's the shade even. I didn't even realise that. I just love the colour. But yeah, I swatched it earlier and it's kind of still on my hand. You probably can't see it, but... And then I picked up this little set of uh, eyeshadows. I think they're all 6 95 even the lipstick. And I got a, like a matte sort of shimmery pink. And then a really nice shimmery pink here. Then that's a purple, you can't really see it because the lighting's a bit shit, it looks more like black. But it is a really nice shimmery purple, I might do a little tutorial with them in. But these are literally like my day to, day, day what? Daily colours, like pink eyeshadow, a little bit of a nudie pink lip, but this one's a bit more out there. But I do love a bit of purple and pink together and a pink lip. We also went into Pull and Bear, and I never ever go in this shop. I don't even know why I should go in there often, because I bought a hot orange nail varnish this was like 2 95 i think and i don't even have this color i thought it'd be really nice to have some nails that like that but i haven't even worn them yet i like to just have the pure color on my nails and i really really like that color then i got this gorgeous highlight i will open it up and show you i can't even see the color that well but oh my god it was an absolute glow on my hands it was so nice yeah that was i think it was like 4.95 how could i not pick this up this was only i think it was 5.95 no it's 4.99 i thought when i do my makeup tutorials this is literally what i'm gonna wear hashtag get rid of me but it's a unicorn so it's like very very big and it's such nice quality as well so definitely gonna be something for the videos and then i picked up this roll net from pollen bear as well which was a little bit more pricey but I wanted a good quality roll net so that's £15.99 feels really nice and soft I love the quality of this and it's going to look really nice in winter and autumn I'm very very happy with what I picked up especially this and this oh I love it bargains all ready now about to go out wearing my new headband from the peach kind of course obviously it matches my dress that's the whole point love it this is from misguided and I'm wearing my little mules that I got from a charity shop like ages ago for like Four euro? Four euro. Four pounds. <laughs> so used to the euros here now. But love this. I actually wasn't so sure when it came through, but I actually love it. I've got another one that's being made for me as well, so I'm so excited for this. It's gonna be like so filled with jewels. Really love my makeup as well actually. I used the Armani Silk Foundation, I had a little sample part of it, which I got through the post that I got from one of the swipe up links again from my in the for Lydia. I know it's one of them, but I'm actually loving this foundation, I might have to buy it. Mm. Love it. And I did the flick again. I'm used to doing that more often now. On my lips, I have the Huda Beauty, one of my favourites. Don't know what shade it is. It's angelic. Yeah, really love that. So I'm gonna go out and have some drinkies. Really love my makeup. Got the earrings in as well. Nice little sample. Just go again. I've got a coffee. 
a little owl cup kiosk little thing so it probably doesn't want to focus in it, it's that dark. Good morning, oh that's very very bright. Just about to head into San Antonio again but it's super super windy today because there was a storm last night, like 2 o'clock when we got back. We went to this Irish bar, oh my god it was so funny. I think it was um, amusing everyone and there was loads of different people in there dancing and it was, it was so funny. We just sat there watching and laughing at things. But last night we came back at like 2 o'clock and it, there was like an electric storm over San Antonio. It looked, like there was a, it looked kind of like a sunset in the clouds but every few seconds but... It looked amazing, I was just watching it for a little bit. Um, but it's really, really windy this morning. It's been windy all night. And we ain't gonna get a water taxi today looking at that sea. We're just about to head out. I'm wearing um, Dior Addict on my lips in this shade. Wonderful, 561, I've had this for a couple of years now. A bit of a walk today, because we ain't getting no boat. Right. As you can see, super, super windy out there. Not many people sunbathing today. We've got a walk all the way over there so all the way around it's gonna take us about 50 minutes yeah lots of parallels out there just went in the british supermarket and found a sausage roll but what was it that guy called is it landy yeah yeah and then i found this little thing called the sausage roll and then it's got one here what is it like it's quite nice actually is it was it 150 yeah yeah and i've got dairy free birds we start for a pit stop for a smoothie and a coffee. Cheapest ones we found. How much was your coffee? One ninety for large. Ninety for large. That's good, isn't it? Yeah, we found the uh, the corn shop with yes, the sausage roll in it. I don't know if I've found one. Didn't eat one, but yeah. The smoothie is actually really nice. We've got banana and strawberry. What happened to strawberries? It doesn't forever. I haven't bought anything yet though, surprisingly. I bought more in Ibiza the Old Town than I have in this side of the island. It's a shock. We've just stopped for a minute and taken the views. It's so windy, but... It's doing for the gram over there. Currently wandering around all the souvenir shops. So I like to buy so many different things, like I like to get a tea towel, a towel. Like it, key ring, loads of the random things, probably fun. fan. Let's see what I buy. I'll show you later. Tempted to get James one of these because he loves this drink. Make the bottle over. I don't know. Hmm. I found good on the dark unicorns. Now we're in a Spanish white rose. Oh, it's an English shop, but they always seem to come in these food shops, I don't even know why. Yeah, what food we get, we just take home anyway. We're now sat in the. Where are we actually? We're in the Curry Palace. The Curry Palace, yeah. Curry, curry Palace. We're in the Curry Palace, which is literally called Curry Palace. That's like Curry Palace. We've both got a chicken here. Oh, we're going to have a naan bread, some rice, some chips, some curry. Can't wait for this. I'm loving it. We went to the Silver Place, you probably saw this earlier in the vlog. The Silver um, Place was closed, we found this one, so it's not, it's more like a 15 minute walk from my hotel. So, yeah, this looks like Look at all this good food. Oh my god, look at the naan bread. It smells incredible. We absolutely demolished that. It was incredible. It was so good. The naan bread was like perfect. We've been in this shop before. We're coming here. Oh, it's just, it was so good. It was called the Curry Palace, if you ever want to go. It's one really dark, not that there. Curry Palace in San Antonio Bay. Amazing. Oh, it's back. Why is Stacy in a t-shirt? <laughs> this is where we've been going. What is it called? Urban Lounge Ibiza. It's going to be banging in the evening. It's quite good. Also went here at this Irish pub as well. Which was really good last night. Now we're on hunt for ice cream. Even though I shouldn't have them. But because I'm on holiday, I kind of like let loose from the diet. And have like everything. So the vegan dog kind of like goes out the window. So I'm trying to find an ice cream really really love the kinder buenos are so nice there's literally none down our end they're always off the other end so that's annoying so hopefully i can have a different kinder bueno it's like a cone rather than like the chocolate bar ice stick. cream things yeah stick we haven't found ice cream yet yeah but we found an extra large trolley burger we've been looking for them for ages but i went oh adam's got this too what is it uh -huh. We've got it in the shop for like 25 cents. It looks like a Jaffa cake, but then it looks like a chocolate pancake. 
Does cake. it taste good? Yeah, it's a Is it a Jaffa cake? No? That's a nice car. Nice. And we're back in the hotel and we've bought quite a few souvenirs. So I'm going to go through them with you and show you what I bought. I didn't even do this on my last video. Then again, when I did Zante, I didn't actually vlog. So you wouldn't have seen what I bought. But I tend to buy the same sort of things, but something slightly different every time. But I've tried to get like a snow globe or, well, and a tea towel, a towel, a magnet, <coughs> a key ring, and something else. So believe it or not, this is not everything. I have more that I'm going to buy. So I've got... Three little magnets, I think that was like one euro fifty. But I love these, they're so pink and purple. Really cute with the little sand things on. So I've got one for myself, which I think I'm going to have the dolphin one. That's probably for my brother, and then that's probably for my mum. And then I got my stepdad a boat, I love that. I'm going to get my plain thing, but this is for my sister. It's a cute little necklace with a name on it. And then I have this, which I'm going to put in my room, because I want to get a shelf up in my room so I can have all my souvenirs on it from when we've been on holiday I think this was like 195 from La Serena at least this shop here and then I got Stacy yes Stacy I got you little presents this is a little snow globe with all the little it's not really snow it's like a sand globe is that what it's called yeah there's a, there's a starfish in there somewhere where is it there you go sticking out and then got this for Stacy as well um and then I got myself this for my room oh obviously it's pink but this has got little seashells in it as well. Love seashells. I think this was like four euros, something like that. Bought some bubbles, they were reduced to like 50 cents. And then I saw this and smelt it, and it's the only one left. But like, it had no lid, so I had to find a lid and it was cracked. But 4 99 it smells like one of the Victoria's Secret sprays, but like slightly different. So, like that Orchid Wonderland. And then I bought more of these sweeties. I'll take it back with us because these were so nice. And then I bought my dad this. <laughs> Because he uh, likes trucks. So I bought him that for his little office. And then I uh, bought myself a tea towel for a future house. And I love all these flowers that I've got around Ibiza. So it's that sort of vibe. What else have I got in here? I don't think I've got anything else. Just got another burger. Yeah. Because I love these. That's pretty much it. Yeah. I love getting all the souvenirs. But tomorrow I'm going to get a towel, a key ring, and I don't know what else. I can't remember now. Magnet. One more magnet for someone else. And then a key ring. I think that's it. I did say towel, didn't I? Yeah. I need towels are. I'm quite happy with the uh, souvenirs and things that I picked up over the week. I think yesterday and today have done the best because uh, this bag is filled with all the things that I got from yesterday. It's completely full with all the stuff. I'm not looking forward to going home. We've got one full day left. We are on Tuesday today. We got here on Thursday. Yeah, yeah. We're slowly coming to an end, but tomorrow we're going to sit on the beach and watch the sunset. So that'd be really cute. I'm probably gonna have a pool day and buy the rest of our souvenirs and basically pack. Just, we have to be at the airport for like half nine on Thursday because our flight's at like 12 and our um, transfer comes at like nine. I've just realised that the strap has fell off again. Great. I need to make that secure. It keeps falling off. I do hope you're enjoying the vlog so far as much as me and I'd have been loving this holiday. I really enjoyed it. By the way, we've been going south catering and before our first holiday we went half board um, and we still ate out every day and had lunch and then the next holiday we went to Poland and we had bed and, bed and breakfast. We ate out a lot then. Then we went to Zanti and we went bed and breakfast and we ate out a lot then but now that we've gone south catering, you no, know, it's just save a lot more money. And because we've been eating in more, it's helped. I'm not being funny, I've actually preferred cooking. But I say I've been cooking, Adrian's been cooking quite a lot. This is a good little cook cut. Yeah, I really, really enjoy self-catering because we've not spent as much money as what we could have been eating out every single day. We've just been cooking most of the time and taking lunch out with us. And um, because we've been going to these supermarkets called Oroski. And then there's one that's not far from here, like a five or ten minute walk I can't remember it's got so, so it has like all the good stuff in there we had some bolognese stuff from there so it's been really good going south catering I think we definitely do it again especially for like a week long place if we're going to get in an apartment like we've got here not even a bad size room to be fair we're staying at the Playa Bella Apartments I was about to say apartmentos then it's a beautiful view over San Antonio Bay and we're next to the Amer Hotel which is a gorgeous hotel and then the Paradiso and then the other side of San Antonio Bay where we went to see the WikiWoo Hotel Cubanito they're so Instagrammable I'm so happy with the shots we got yes Instagram game is going oh and we're going to shut up now we're going to go get ready to go out soon to that Irish bar that I showed you earlier it was really really good in there I want to go play some pool in the urban lounge Ibiza as well and um, next to that is where we went to play crazy golf 
which was like four euros definitely recommend that the place that we're staying at, i would recommend staying at it's such a lovely location it's just so nice and it's not even overly expensive either anyway i'm gonna go see you whenever the next clip is gonna come this is my outfit of the night it's dress from femme lux absolutely love it done my makeup as well kind of like dark again but gold eyes with my voice is really croaky why is it croaky oh see this glow this is the Suva highlighter. I'll show you what it is. Hang on. It's this little beauty that I got out of the cohorted box. So good. Such a good. So we're going to go out now. I'm not going to take you with us. The strap is broken and I need to fix it. And mainly film on my phone when we go out in the evening anyway. So let's see you now. I'll see you in the morning. So for our last day in Ibiza. Boo! so sad. But Disneyland in January. So it's our final day. Boo! But we're having a pool day and getting souvenirs today, so we're in my Miami uh, swim suit from Primark that I got a couple of years ago. And uh, we shall see if I can get a tan, go for a little bit of a swim. Just enjoy the day, our final day, which I'm quite sad about, but it's a beautiful day, so yeah. <laughs> So I'm enjoying just sitting here and reading the sun. I don't even know if you can hear me the water really loud in the background. A little swim. I just don't want to go in tomorrow. Back to reality. Like, we're not back to work till Monday, but I just don't want to go in. We'll stay forever. We're back upstairs now. I just got changed into my £1 charity shop dress. Yes. And I'm wearing these cute little earrings as well. And then all my booth buns. Because it's going to be the last time that we're going to be wearing them to go home tomorrow. No. We're going to get the rest of the souvenirs and probably stop off somewhere and have a coffee. It's about 10 past 3 in Ibiza and yeah, we've got like, I mean 24 hours we'll be back in the UK. Boo! Just stop for a quick drink and I bought this towel which actually matches my nails, which is cute. Got some sweets and things now which we will later look at the Abbey. Cool cafe. Do not drink. Back at the hotel, we've found a trampoline. <laughs> <laughs> Do a backflip. <laughs> oh, we have way too much fun. <laughs> oh my god, let's see if I can do a, a, a sit drop while holding the camera. Oh my god, this is going to be scary. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Oh my god! <laughs> How can you do? Now we're sat on the beach, watching the sun go down. What we can see of it. It's a little spot. It's not much of a beach, but it's quite cute. Little blanket. And I've got my magazine and some Cheetos. I'm not sure what it looks like here too. It's lovely. Back in the hotel now. We just went and explored the. Um, abandoned sort of building there so we're going to take photos but me being an absolute wimp I didn't want to go up upstairs in it because I was scared that it was going to like collapse or something because you don't even you don't know when things like that have been abandoned you don't know whether they're safe to even go up because obviously we're not in England it's not completely shut off so I just don't want to leave but luckily go to Disneyland in January with the girls Woo! so excited we're, we're going to do a Disney Primark haul for that probably like a few weeks before so look out for that video probably it's in january time though so that's when it will be up so but yeah I'll, I'll vlog at disney again like i did uh, i think it went for three years oh my god has it been three years ago on what it was oh my god so long ago but i wonder where we're gonna venture to next year possibly portugal depends where we go just depends hmm exciting isn't it yeah i'm gonna miss this place see like i said well, i think i said this before just staying at the player bella hotel apartments thing and you've got this amazing view behind us. Is it gonna focus on it? There you go. This view from our apartment room. Obviously you've got the pool down there as well, which is literally looks like Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Definitely gonna miss it yeah. Right now we're gonna cook some dinner. Mine was last night's leftover bolognese. Oh, was it last night? Yeah, yesterday's lunch was similar, like whenever it was. I've got dinner tonight, we're gonna eat the rest of the food. And then we're gonna go out and play a bit of pool, the Urban Lounge Ibiza. 
and then probably the Irish bar if it's still open because everywhere's literally like closed it's like we're literally at the end of the season now so everywhere's closing Mambo's closed Guinea Kitchen's closed all the little bars down here are closed and a fair few shops are closed as well so that's a bummer at least we're going home at the right time I suppose I don't want to go home let's fly to Zanti instead or somewhere else I'm going to America actually I'm going to stop rambling so we're going to have to dinner and pack unfortunately probably see you in the morning bye good morning it's the last day I'm so gutted. So obviously, we're at the end of the vlog now, guys. Boo! But please give the video a thumbs up. <laughs> so I really hope you've enjoyed our adventure to Ibiza and all the fun things we've been getting up to. And we'll probably be coming back when it comes like to in season or in summer in a few years' time. I've been here before and I didn't get to experience it properly. We came in October last time, but it's been such a nice holiday. It's been absolutely lovely. We've saved money so well here as well. People say it's so expensive, but I'm not even if you treat, if you do go to the right places, eat the right things, drink the right things. We haven't had any alcohol whatsoever. Would you believe it? Um, but yeah, we're going home this weekend, and I'm actually going to drink. It won't be like excessive, but it's stupid prices for alcohol out here. But obviously, that's the, the reason why a lot of people come out to get pissed. So yeah. I hope you like this video guys and I shall see you in the next video which will be a Halloween makeup tutorial so I'll see you soon. Bye! Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>